Hi, everyone. Hi. So tonight we are making a special tea for me. Uh, this was a recipe that my grandma was passed, grandma. Um, but she passed on to me, and it is a white enchilada, um, and she used to make it with pork. A white enchilada? White enchiladas. Oh, well, I don't know what that is. I've seen a lot of chicken recipes for it, but my mom, my grandma used to make them with pork. That sounds good. Yes. Pork and enchiladas, because, like, chicken enchiladas are good, but pork sounds even better. Well, I'm allergic to chicken anyway, oh. so... I guess that's true. It works out that she would make them with pork. Mm -hmm. So, um, on the side, we're also making... A seven-layer dip. So... Um, and that is by ahead of time, like the, the herb time, cute. Um, so I feel like the two of them will go well together. So let's get started. I'm excited. This sounds delicious. Hi, I'm Penay. I'm Paige. And I'm Pam. And, and we're, we're the, the Pestos. Pestos. This is a dab of crazy. Make sure to hit the like button. Don't forget to Okay, so um, I don't know what you're doing. We're, you're gonna have to tell me what to do because I didn't look at the instructions. There is no such instructions oh, yeah. in my head. So. Oh yeah, so you're gonna kind of have to tell me what. To I do. am. So yeah. if you want to? Will you grab a big pot first? Okay, so if, if you want to open the green chilies, I really don't, but I guess I will. I just can't open it. We're gonna open. We're gonna um. Where is it? Oh, it's, okay. it's in there. It's in the first drawer. Helps if I look there. So I already made the pork, and Easy. you insta pot it. I did. Um, the beautiful thing about an insta pot, insta pots are just beautiful in general. Let's just say that. Well, mine isn't so much anymore, but <laughs> That's um, you have kids. I had a like two and a half pound um, pork, roast? pork roast, three pound pork roast mm. that was frozen solid. Oof. Took it out of the deep freeze, put it in my Instapot, three hours in the Instapot, and um, it's literally it all the way done. Started. So, from the deep freeze to three hours later, and we shredded it. So. Normally, it probably would take like a whole day. If you can even, you, it takes a whole day when it's defrosted. Exactly. See? The love of Instapots. That's why Don't I love Instapots. Don't anyway. this away. So, um, I just added nice green chilies into the the mixture. I put taco the seasoning pork. in here. In oh. the pork, yes. I guess it so, is. So, that is the meat mixture. Um, meat. Pork. Check it. I don't know what I'm saying. What I'm going to have... Oop, I just lost the fork. Oh, no. Don't do that. <laughs> I'm gonna have you do. Oh, it's it not so good. I'm sorry. Cheese it. Cheese it. Yes. So if you want to add, can I use the rest of the bag? No. Well, now you cheese it already. Okay, mix that up. I am gonna start mm -hmm. mixing in my okay. nails. Cheese. Mmm. -hmm. Cheese. We need to sprinkle it. So. Sprinkle it. The. You want to scoot over? Cause. Yeah. Take. Take these. Okay. Oh, she hits me in the face. <clears throat> so, the other part of what needs to happen is the white sauce. Oh, that's why they're called white enchiladas. Yeah. Because it's white sauce that goes on. I thought we were being racist. <laughs> no. I was like, is there black enchiladas and white enchiladas? That's, if there isn't any black enchiladas, then that's just racism. That's what I have to say. We're using black olives. All right, it's equal now. All right, so a cup of milk. Using pork. So I had a you had a tub of sour cream, but it got eaten. So I'm mainly just using one of my She's the one that loves sour cream. But I'm just using one of my squeeze tubes. I'm gonna eyeball it because I don't trick. feel like trying to put oh, it in a cup and then. Oh, that's like wait that takes way too long to get it out of the cup. Well I waste sour cream too so that too. 
Oh, it helps if it's open. <laughs> okay, so the sour cream is mostly um, sour cream and milk. It is the sour cream and milk. So I'm yes. gonna add a little bit of flour, about a spoonful, <laughs> so that um, that helps that thicken hair? it up. There's a hair in here. Naughty, naughty hair. Ew. Okay, so now I'm going to add pork. Cubes of, oops, as long as it As long as there. it's cubed. I don't think you should put the giant thing in there. You want to um, start mixing? Because it is already. Give me the beautiful little heart spoon. Starting beautiful. to. So you want to kind of, um, yeah. Adjust, like smush, smush it down. Yeah, you're just trying to get the sour, I mean, not sour cream, the cream cheese to melt. So, I'm enjoying the cool air. Yeah. Okay, so just keep watching it. Make sure it's... Give me a spoon. I'll mash it all up. So, I am going to start making our... Enchiladas. Enchiladas. I'm excited for the dip. The seven yes. layer dip? How is it going to be seven layers? Because there's layers. Well, I guess that's true. Did you know you can layer different liquids on top of each other based on their consistency? Onions! It's like onions! Layers? No. Oh. Oh! What, what is that from? I've heard that, but I don't... Shrek! Shrek and Donkey. Oh, it is like that! I have layers! Oh. And then Donkey goes, Oh! So you're telling me you're an onion! <laughs> he is an onion. <laughs> Like that. So now we're just gonna take Angela. Oh my neck. Oh ah! my neck. How do you crack your neck, Mom? So like that. So now we're just gonna do this, you know, a couple thousand times. Packet. Full. <laughs> uh it's kinda starting to stick to the bottom now. Okay, then turn it down and keep spinning. Keep pulling, I mean. Whirling. Got it. I'm a ballerina. You, here. I put him in the tortilla. You roll him up and then I put him in here. Go on this side of me. <gasps> you put it in the tortilla. Make See it about how much I did? Like this? Maybe a little less. Nah, it's too much. Too little, I mean. I'm going to make a big... See? About how, like, what it is. And there's, like, a log of it. Like that? Maybe, like, I'll use my hands. Makes it easier. Like that? That's too much. Oh. There. Mm -hmm. Alright, I'm going to attempt to make this. So you just kind of roll it up. Do you put it on the side more or just in the middle? Like, like this? I move it to the side. Oh, you put it over here? So I roll, that's too much. It might be. I roll it, and then I... It's going to be a fat one. Mm, mm. Okay, we need the other tortilla to, I mean, not enter. Casserole dish? Yeah. We got a little bit extra meat, so we're just Stuff filling it. in a few Stuff of the tortillas. Those tiny little dudes. Mmm. Okay, you got two more to. And we've got enough meat for both of them. I'll take like this and like. You do a scoop, and here's one more. So you oh. got three, so divide three scoops. It doesn't look like enchilada sauce to me. Uh, I want some help with the action of mine. I don't see anything. Ooh. Okay. Trying to get every last drop eh. of the cream. Oh, it's cream, not sauce. 
Cream sauce. Cream so like Alfredo sauce, kind of. Mm. Alfredo sauce is a cream sauce, right? Sure. I consider it a cream sauce. So if you want to get um, the <laughs> uh, um, olives, black olives. Open them? Yes. Ah! More cheese. And then are we gonna put all of them? Drain right? those. Yeah, I was gonna say, do I drain these? Alright, put a little bit on top. That was not sprinkled enough. Oh, we're making these enchiladas! I have tried these before. There. They look like little droplets of black paint. Let's say that. I was gonna say. For some reason, I was gonna say of empty space. It looks like little drops of empty space. Of the sky. Of the sky at night. Not a drop of the sun, not a drop of the moon, no stars, no, just empty space. Ah! ah! Okay, so let me get these in. Hopefully, I didn't smoke up again. Oh. Uh, Tad bit came out. Here. Take it. Mm. How long do those go for? Echo, set a timer for 20 minutes. Oh, okay. Wahoo! Alright, so. The dip time. It's okay, so I'm all not alright, so. You want to give me the. Beans? Beans. Fudge. That, that's tomato. Open it. Beans! How come whenever I think of beans, I think of uh, the guy from the Goonies? Hey, you guys! So smooth that out so it's all over the, the first layer. She says to mix the sour cream and the cream cheese. I just don't see... And taco seasoning. Yeah, but first I want to get the cream the cheese. The stuff all mixed. How much? You just gonna add the rest? Yes, because I don't even know what she said, so. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, so fun. I feel like I have to, like, mash this in. Softening cream cheese probably would have been much better idea. Yeah, she doesn't say that, so. <laughs> Softened cream cheese. I thought when I saw cheddar cheese, I thought that was cream cheese, and it's just shredded, so I was very confused for a second. One oh. plus one half cup. Wait, I want to open it. I could just rip it. I'd rather cut it. Okay. It makes me feel happy. Out of the way. spread over beans. Fine mesh. Yeah, man. Okay, right. so next is guacamole. Oh, guacamole. The most I beautiful agree. thing in the world. You know what's open. crazy? Paisley is the only one in our entire family that does not like guacamole. She's right. crazy. She just doesn't like avocado on it. Help me out here. I'll, I'll hold it open. Mm. Yeah, because I'm using this whole thing. Mm. It's three layers. Get every little good bit of block out of here. And get off off the lid, too. Oh, I'm gonna. <laughs> I am trying to get it all. I love homemade guacamole. That's always good. Yes, but the store-bought kind that is, like, made at the store, is, I didn't fully understood what she meant, but she said to strain the sour cream before you put That's it on. That's salsa, not I mean, sour the, cream. The salsa. That, that, there's two very different things. I suppose you can't strain salsa, that, or sour cream, oh, that would be weird. <laughs> but, so that it's not, like, super... Wet. Wet and watery. Ew. To strain it down. 
and then slap it on there. Though I tried my best to drain it, there's still a little bit. It's juice. still juicy. 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 So mm. it's still there. But But it's not as juicy as it would be if we just poured it all in. Oh yeah. It would have been soup. Yeah. But it looks pretty. And delicious. It looks like one of those pudding cups you can get at the store with like, each individual layer. Parfait is delicious. That's what it looks like. A parfait. Sure. We were talking about layers earlier. Layers. Onions. Okay. <laughs> no? Oh. Onions. I feel like you're Shrek and I'm Donkey. No, Dad is Shrek for sure. Put some cheese on it? Cover it with cheese. Cover it? Mm-hmm. Hey, not everything. Do we Try get to, to melt get it? as much cheese into it as possible. Do we melt it all on top? No. What? Sir, immediately with our cheese. Our crackers? I thought you said, sir, immediately. I'm all, who's sir, immediately? <laughs> Sir, <laughs> immediately. It's the guy that um that you eat immediately. Yeah. Everything that you're supposed to eat immediately is now sir immediately. All right. So my mother-in-law bought pico de gallo, which, which I think totally will go great on it. Is a definitely a good choice. So we're gonna sprinkle some of that on. Mmm. Pico de gallo is always so good. Doesn't it? No, that's bell peppers. Green bell peppers. It has peppers. picos and de gallos. The guy. Oh. I'm just kidding. Geico! Olives. Olives. Oh, this looks definitely Mexican. It looks pretty good. And this was such an easy meal. I didn't want to just do beans and I'm rice. Like the rest of this. Echo stuff. And a lot of them. So um, I thought, <gasps> what else could we do that's a good side dish to the enchiladas? So here we go. Ooh. Oh. They look tasty. I was about to say something, and then I saw the enchiladas, and it completely en exited my mind. And I'm like, never mind. I want to look at those. Oh. Mm. Don't these look amazing? Oh. They look so good. They look like weirdly shaped and weirdly looking chocolate chip cookies. So, they look like chocolate along chip with our... Seven layer uh, dip dip. It looks pretty good. And this was a half hour of making dinner. Oh, I'm so excited. Pretty good. 30 minutes. Yes. Of enchiladas and a dip. Aside from the three hours that it took to cook the pork, but <laughs> literally that was, I left it in my Instant Pot and just, it cooked. So. I had to leave and go do some stuff while she waited for it. But anyway, we're going to eat. This looks delicious, and it was quick, and it was easy, so enchilada time! Woo! For the enchiladas will be on the blog, since that is in my head. Um, so I'll put that on there. Oh, that's not a bad idea. But yeah, recipes for this will be on the blog also. Um, so link is down in the description below. So, bye. Can we go eat enchiladas now? Yes. Woohoo!